have my little bowl of oats. I haven't had oats in forever. Anyway, so let's catch up on what's going on. So, today I was going to film a 5 a.m. morning routine, just seeing if it was doable. Obviously my body has decided it's not doable because it slept through my arms. I woke up at around 9 a.m. I don't know why I did for the, until 9 a.m. until 10 a.m. I guess I must just go and distract on my phone. And it's so around 10 a.m. had my shower. Um, so what's going on today? Well, at some point today, I am having someone from my student accommodation. I'm going to add cacao nibs to my oats. At some point today, I'm going to have some someone from the student accommodation I live in have a look around my flat in my room, which I don't like because it's like a strange come into your living space. And then I need to leave around 12 o'clock, I think it is, um, to go get a contact lens check. So basically, last time I got glasses was in 2016, so that's about five years ago. And when I went to get one a few weeks ago, when I was visiting home, the contact lens person turned around to me, added chia seeds, they turned around to me and they said, you could probably do with some contact lenses instead of glasses. So, yeah. And I had to wait like two months to find an appointment there. And I was like, well, I'm coming back to the city in like just a few weeks or days or I had no idea the time span. This does not look nice at all. Um, but yeah. I did some blueberries and this is what it sort of looks like. So yeah, and so I've read up loads on like the kind of appointments and also putting on contact lenses and I've priced things up and apparently you're not meant to wear makeup when putting on contact lenses. You're meant to put on makeup afterwards, so I decided that I was gonna go makeup free today. So I'll let the baby face out and yeah. So I'm going to have my golden syrup oats with some chia seeds, cacao nibs and blueberries as well as my coffee, just simple decaf without milk because I'm very jittery recently and I just don't believe I need more of a reason to be jittery today when I'm going to be putting something in my eyes. Asthmatic, and I have this inhaler that's pink. And when I have it for the next few hours, I get really jittery, like I get the shakes. And so I've made the unwise decision to not have it this morning. I'll have it when I come back this afternoon because, like I said, I don't want to be like this when I'm trying to put contact lens in. Um, it fades away, but I just don't want to risk it because every day is a bit different. And so, yeah. Would you believe it? The other night I had proper anxiety over the idea that someone from my accommodation was going to come over and inspect my flat and the inspection would take 10 minutes. I thought that they were like going to check my room because there was something about making sure that your desk is clear and all that and so I had proper anxiety over it like I couldn't sleep and it turned out it was literally just checking that my door opens and shuts so checking that it does this. Seriously, this is all it was, and I struggled to sleep over it. Because I didn't like the idea of someone coming to my room when I was there, when I was not there, and all that. Okay, so it's about half eleven now. I didn't finish my breakfast. I just, I don't know if I got bored of it or I just felt full. But either way, I didn't finish that. Um, so food was wasted and has played a bit. One thing I miss about having a dog is being able to just, if I can't finish my food, I can just give it to him. Either way, that's done now. Um, don't know how well I can hear me because I put my window open. But yeah, so, done that. I've got about half an hour until I need to leave my flat. I cut my finger last night because I put bleach on the floors. But yeah, I cut my finger last night. Um, so, I bleached my floors in the kitchen because they weren't fully clean 
um, there hadn't been for a while because there was like an area around the fridge that had like white dots everywhere from like, well, I thought my tire just seemed from milk leaking and I used acetone on it a while back and that didn't work to remove it so last night I decided to use bleach on it, like raw bleach and that worked and then I discovered one of the white stains which I don't know how we never noticed it or maybe I was the only one that didn't notice it. We got a tringle squashed on the floor. So I started attacking it with a knife to get it off and yeah, my finger fell foul of that knife. It's only got about an inch cut on my finger, well spe specifically my thumb. Um, which luckily it's not my right hand because I'm right handed but nevertheless it's annoying because I keep forgetting I have it and so I'm doing things and of course the skin on my thumb is flexing and all that and yeah it just opens up constantly. And the thing is, I feel it happening like I just felt it right now. But the thing is, I don't look at it until a while later. By the time I look at it, it's already dried up again. So, yeah. I feel like I'm tired. And I want to get things done. But I'm leaving half an hour, so I can't get anything started right now. But yeah, this has been my realistic sort of morning routine. It is now time for me to leave. I'm going to be late. I hope I don't miss my train. And um, yeah, I'm gonna head out now. And I'm gonna carry you out onto my phone because that's the easiest way to transport you. And um, yeah, so let's go into town and get my eyes sorted. Let's see if I am worthy of getting caught like lenses. I didn't know the teeth. Honey, do you remember when we used to laugh and love? So we last forever before the cruel heavens above. I'm gonna take you away, cause I ain't the same without your taste, your loving touch. We've been making our way out through suburban avenues, sun the skies around us, turning black from perfect blue. And to my surprise, I took a look in your eyes and felt a sense of something. from the reception and um, I've got a bit of shopping that I did on my way back from my eye appointment so basically the woman put some orange dye in my eyes I don't know if it's still visible no my eyes are white um, and then she just made me look in all different directions and then she also did this weird thing it wasn't painful at all it was just really a weird feeling where she picked up my eyelid to like look around or behind my eye, I don't know. Um, so that was done. And then she set me an appointment a few weeks from now to, I guess, ordering different contact lenses and try them on. And then from there, I'll see how my eyes work with contact lenses, if that does the job or not. And yeah, so I'll keep you in the loop about that. But that is it. I'm just going to end the video here for today. Because this was just meant to be about my morning routine. And it just so happened that my day was all over the place. So this is a little bit of a glimpse into four hours of my life. Now I'm just going to have a late lunch because it's half two. And then I'll just get on with editing this video because I have nothing else planned for the day. As far as I'm aware. So, yeah, that is it for today's video. And, yeah. I've got nothing else to say. I, I hate saying like, comment, subscribe because I just find it really cringy. You do it if you want to. And, yeah, I'm gonna end it here. Bye!